Hey everybody, this week got a brand new laptop. So this week I'm gonna teach you guys how to download R and download R Studio onto your machine to be able to run R and to be able to go back if you haven't installed R already, to be able to go back to my previous videos and code with baseball data. So to get started, we will go on rproject.org and that's where we'll get the mirror for R. So now to download R, we'll click on this link. And it gives us basically crane mirrors that are based on you know various locations. So we'll go down to USA. We can pick any of these crane mirrors that I'm nearby. So we'll just pick uh, Washington University of St. Louis, and then we'll download it for our machine. So we'll say download R for Windows, since this is a Windows. And you'll read the subdirectories. Uh, this is what you want to install R for the first time for base. So then you'll click on that. And then you'll download R.3.6.2. Now that R has been downloaded, we now have to download the interface for R, for R to be able to run it. So that's where RStudio comes in. So you can go on rstudio.com slash products slash rstudio slash download. I will, again, will leave a link for both of these for people who can get to it quicker. And then we'll scroll down. Um, the one I recommend is RStudio Desktop. That's what I've used before. I'd like to try RStudio Server, but I'm not going to download it just yet, just because you can access it via a web browser. Now, some of these, you can, if you want, you can get it, but I, I, don't, I ain't got the financial capital for that. So we'll do... Download our Studio Desktop. Download our Studio for Windows. Now that we have our studio downloaded and the necessary files, we now can go into our studio. So to kind of change this layout, you go to Tools, Global Options, Appearance, and you can select what kind of appearance you want here. 